All right, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Fantasy, Weapon Shop Fantasy. Man, this text does not look good. Uh, this zoomed in. Anyway, it's uh, I think it's Japanese. I'm not actually sure uh, what country of origin this has, but it's not English uh, or American or whatever. Uh, I know this is translated, so the grammar is going to be a little bit weird. So let's let's start. So I guess let's be this guy. We look like a vampire. Um. Let's be, um... Botula. Botula? Isn't Botula, like... I don't know, we're gonna be Botula. <laughs> we look creepy! Well, we're down. Oh, sweet. Uh, we also get a pet, so we can have... A small variety of dogs and or cats. I'm gonna go with this one, I really like, uh, Scottish Terriers. Okay. It was a calm and peaceful... It was calm and peaceful at beginning. As... A successful vampire, I lived happily in my castle. Hey, we are a vampire! At that time, sunshine was not long. At that time, food was plump and abundant. But did not last long. One day, a vampire hunter broke into my castle. Remind me the terror of holy water and whips. Welcome to my castle. Visitor center is 500 meters ahead. Please take off your shoes before enter. Oh. Please don't. I beg of you. Please be gentle. Oh. I was forced to run away from my home. Now my life is beset with hardships. I will always remember the name of my enemy. Belmont. So it's a Castlevania reference. Yay. I mean, go freaking figure. Whips and holy water. Oh no! I am bat now! You can't see me. You can't see me. Uh, come on, I'm also a vampire. Give me back my money! The money I borrowed? I spent it all. I knew it. That's why I'm here today. To fix this problem for you. If you don't do as I say, I will tie you up and hand you to that sadist myself. He's been looking for you everywhere. I'm sure he'd be happy to see you. Belmont. I would not have to be here if it wasn't for him. I, I don't know if I should voice these characters. I don't know how much of a plot there is. Okay, Shell's nodding at me, so... Oh, my castle. Then you better listen. I'd like you to run a weapon shop. Just between you and me, I've heard that the war is about to start. You're gonna make a fortune. Uh, first, I'm gonna lend you some money to get started. Oh, you bring me takeout food. For God's sake, this is not takeout food. She's your first staff. Takeout food? Where is it? I can't do female voices. Growl, growl. Hungry. Um, hungry. You two are pigs. Okay. This is very a very slow start. Be patient, everybody. Hope you're satisfied. Yes. Me too. You'll have to pay me back these too. Now, you are in charge of weapons crafting. Take this recipe and start up money. I will keep record along with interest, compound interest, insurance fee, processing fee. Oof. All right. So, get reward. 1500G, branch one, sharpened branch recipe get, new staff get, confirm. 
Okay, tutorial for beginner. Clip shot, click shop button. You can change decorations and do the shopping here. Uh, shop. Okay. Tutorial for beginner. Find craft table and confirm to buy. Craft tables are used to craft materials and equipments. Requires one staff. Okay, craft, craft table. Find chest to confirm buy. Chests are used to store your crafted equipments. You can upgrade chests to increase storage room. Oh, boss kills. Huh. That's interesting. Go. Oh, I see. Okay, tutorial for beginner. Click staff button. You can see them in details. Click clit clitch work button. Your staff will automatically go to an available working spot. Work. Find craft table. You can see the staff using it and all equipments you can craft. So this one. Okay. Click sharpen branch icon displayed and click craft. If your staff has high decks, have high de- oh wait, no let's go back a bit. If your staff have high decks, they can craft better equipments on craft table. No, got- ah! Okay, no, okay, here we go. However- ah! Ah! <laughs> it's going too fast! However, their average points also affect their wages. Wait for your equipment to be complete. Time required for crafting depends on certain points of your staff, craft table decks. Quality of equipments crafted vary because of staff's points and luck. Now you should go and complete your mission. If you've done all the equipments asked on the mission, it is time to deliver. Click mission icon. You will receive rewards to help you with the adventure ahead. Okay. So, don't consider your staff as food. Now, take these materials. Have your staff and craft you a sharpened branch. So we get 2000G, 10 branches, new map, new recipe. Deliver. Okay, so we've done that. Now what's going on? Dear customer, here is your sharpened branch. Nice. You are getting the hang of it. Now, you have a lot to do. Collect materials, craft weapons, collect more materials, craft more weapons! The most important thing, sell them and pay me back! But how am I supposed to obtain materials? You know, I might run into a vampire hunter. You will send your staff on their adventures and bring back materials. You will need a horse, equipments for your staff, and skills to match for their trips. They have no idea how to plan their equipments and skills. Thus, you have to do all the thinking for them. Every equipment has their unique skill attached. Never forget to equip your staff before they leave for adventures. Anyway, if you don't pay me back in time, you know who you will have to deal with. So this is like, Holy Potatoes uh, were a vampire shop weapon. Vampire weapon shop. I don't know. Buy a horse in the shop. It is used to send your staff out on adventures. Okay, so we get the reward. 2000G. 10 branches. Uh, new adventure. Ed adventure map. Beginner's forest. Easy. Wood armor recipe received. Wooden helmet recipe received. Wooden sick recipe received. Confirmed. Does it look like we've got... Oh, let's pause it. Oh, that just pulls out the menu. Well, let's save. Not that it really matters. Um, I don't know if this does like a uh, Holy Potatoes a Weapon Shop thing where it's like a day-night cycle or whatnot. Hopefully not. Anyway, uh, so we gotta find a horse here. Horse! Okay. Uh, so click the move icon, bottom left corner. Drag Lisa to the horse. You're coming with me, lady. Alright, so we've dragged her to the horse. Okay. So let's do this. Uh, detail. Okay, so do I have a stick? Do I have anything? Click the switch button. For their first equipment. Wait. Where's Switch? Or is it... No. I don't... Oh, there we go. Okay, this UI is a little bit confusing. Uh, especially because it's way translated. Okay, so... Now does she just go? Oh, here we go. Okay, so we've clicked uh, assist item. I don't think I have any. Uh, we can upgrade horse to lightning. Uh, have 25% chance to recycle materials when adventure. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna be making fun of the English here. I feel kind of bad for that, but at the same time, eh, whatever. Okay, so go on adventure.
What is going on? Why are we not adventure? Rage 5, yes. Detail, yes. Go. Do we... Ad adventure ready? Go. Um... Help? Okay, she made a branch. I... We don't have any other gear to equip. Oh, skill, first aid. Okay, now we go. Now we go? Ah! Okay, so we're missing the skill. Do not want to eat food in adventures? Some skills will help with that. Okay, cool. Yeah, so once we get past the, uh, the horrible, horrible English and whatnot, apparently this is actually supposed to be a pretty good game. Space button can switch between shop and adventure. Adventure. I don't know. Yeah, but, uh, I saw this, uh, uh, somebody tweeted this at me. You know what? While we wait, hopefully this won't screw the game up. Might as well credit the person that actually, uh, found this game for me. Because I wasn't going to find it otherwise. Loading time is a bit of a issue. Okay, credit to, uh, Adrian Niari for finding this one for me. Okay, can I just go back? Did we... Are these just hints, or, like... I guess we're not... What? Oh, now she goes. Oh, so now 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 we're doing adventuring. Okay, so she found slime. Lisa make melee attack or something. Slime use skill melee attack. Oh no, the dangerous melee attack. It's okay. We are better at melee attack than slime is at melee attack. I don't know. <laughs> this is really bad. It's not it's not terrible. Like don't get me wrong, this is not actually like a, a bad game already. It actually, like, it's rough around the edges, but I, I dig the, like, you're a, you're a shop, you fight, uh, well, you're a shop, you send out your dudes to fight for you, they come back with resources, you make new weapons, you equip them with better, and you kind of just, like, a, a constant, uh, a constant little cycle here. Slime make melee attack pose! Oh no, that's even more dangerous, but we do melee attack pose too! So I guess... <laughs> This is so goofy. Eventually we'll have a full team that I can actually start, like, cycling in and out and doing stuff like that. Um, but yeah, when I was playing Holy Potatoes a Weapon Shop, I was actually saying I wanted something like this. That's part of the reason why I'm willing to kind of suffer through this. Because this actually does get closer to one of my, like, ideal games. Uh, as far as I'm con concerned, you know. A sandbox tycoon- tycoon type game where you're- you're fighting enemies, you're- getting loot and whatever, and then you're bringing it back for crafting. I guess Reseteer does the same thing. Um, I just, oh god, that tutorial for Reseteer was so long. I should probably sit down and play it anyway. Um, I actually never ended up playing it because somebody was like furious at me because I wasn't playing it and I'm, I have trouble with anybody yelling at me. So whenever anybody yells at me to do anything, that's usually the point where I completely nix, nix the idea and I'm just like, I'll come back to this when you're gone. Just to snub you, I guess. It's probably a bad, uh... Carrot tastes great! Get int up status, yay! Okay, so we are now smarter. How about melee attack? Well, I guess... Maybe we do extra damage? Unfortunately, I don't have any, um... Unfortunately, I don't have a whole lot of, uh, people, so we pretty much just have to watch this lady... ...fight. And we're just gonna let her go for as long as... ...as possible. I don't know if she, uh... She'll like turn around or whatever when the uh, when the inventory fills up. We'll find out. Um, but yeah, I really like the idea of having like a, a shop tycoon type game where you're gearing up adventurers and sending them out on adventures, and they come back and uh, you know bring you resources and stuff. This might even be that. Like, I don't know if there's going to be a plot for this game. It'd actually be pretty amusing if there was like a direct plot. Like, uh, my adventurers have to go out and raid dungeons to go after Belmont and whatnot. It seems like that's possible, and I'm actually kind of excited for that, because that's kind of a cool thing for me. Unfortunately, we have to go through this... I mean, I actually really dig this this here. Like, the uh, the little adventure lanes look all quite nice, comparatively. Alright, adventure success, we got slime! Um, Alright, reward. Lisa mastered first aid. Okay, so she might just per permanently have that skill? Looks like her HP has gone up. Uh, any of her other stats? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, we'll have to figure out how other stats get, uh, boosted. Okay, so, 
One old friend, prey on the weak. Prey on the weak. You have learned how to craft weapons, but you also need to know how to collect the material. Send your staff to overcome three slime. All right, so we get 10 iron ore, 10 small fur, 500 gold, new recipes. Okay. Three slimes. This is just a piece of cake. Seems to me that you already know how to run this shop. So now I just lay back and relax. Relax? Wait a minute. How much exactly do I owe you? Oh, right. You've had... You've... You have some idea about money now. You did great. How much exactly? Trust me. You do not want to know. How much? All right. Just around five million. What? Five million! Yeah, five million. Five million! Work hard, and you will get there in the next life. See ya! Oh, I have a new mission for you. Don't forget to check it out. Five million! Ah! Okay. Five million. Did I just miss something? All right, so we get reward. We're also saving, so we got some stuff. Recipes. Okay, so first and foremost, I'm going to drag her back to... No. <laughs> What? Oh, okay. Okay, so we got quest. Purchase boss skill pre-order level one. Speed up crafting. Hope it'll help you pay debt faster. Go to work. Pay me back 5,000 gold before I die. Oh, I almost forgot we vampires do not die. Wish you good luck. Reward new map. Okay, anything else? No. Sub. Oh, here we go. Uh, so this person in five minutes wants a leather hat and stuff like that. Oh, well, uh... Leather Trader, Acquisition of Fur, wants three small leather. So let's just deliver that, get a reward. We got 50 gold and I think a new map. Uh, let's see. Need a job desperately. Unfunny man, 200 gold. They'll work for me. Okay, so we get new staff. So I'm hired? Yeah, I could use more help. As a clown, I shall liven up the atmosphere. How about I start with a joke? Once there was a tomato. Stop! We don't need jokes in a weapon shop. But you got to let me finish this one. This is a funny one. Once there was a tomato. Ha 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 ha. Sorry, I can't help it. It's so funny. Okay. So now we get reward. New staff get. All right, so he works there. Uh, let's go to the shop for a hot second. We need to get. Let's get a forge and a furnace. I'm just going to go one of everything and an enchanter. There goes a lot of my money. We're probably fine. Okay, boss skills. Uh, Pre-order level one, two production slots. Ah. I don't have enough money. Okay, snack break. Uh, so we know about slimes, that's fine. Alright, so... Here, let's make, um... Do we want to make a wooden stick or small leather? Let's craft that. So she's just gonna be whining about pineapple this entire time. That's worrying. Okay, Okay, what do you want? I've lots... I've heard a lot of this weapon shop, but without one furnace and one forge cannot be called a weapon shop. Okay, well we already... I already got that. Okay. Give me a weapon. The most basic sharpened branch would do. This is the first step to become a hero. Renumeration is 100 gold. Or 10 gold been altered. Question mark. Okay. Let's craft another... Oh, this is wooden stick. So let's make a sharpened branch. Okay, doing nothing. There we go. Uh, so we go back to sub. Let's see, game of hero. Uh, we get new staff. Dear customer, here is your sharpened branch. Awesome! With this mighty weapon, I shall defeat the slime that bullied. Uh, I shall defeat the slime bullied me the other day. Yes. Here I come. Well, I thought he was, said it was going to be new staff, but. I've got a bad feeling about this. You didn't pay me. Ah, shit. Alright, whatever. Is he coming back, or...? Well, we don't have the interface, so... I don't know. No, you come back! So, how did it go? I don't wanna... I don't wanna talk about it. But I have strong faith. The hero sh shall conquer them all. Give me your finest equipments. I am the man who will be the hero. Yeah, yeah, no problem. 
But you have to pay me for your sharpened branch first. What? A hundred gold? You wrote the mission yourself. The hero shall pay his debt. Okay, so we get we get reward. Ten gold, new staff get. Alright, so let's uh Okay, seriously. How do Oh. Oh, you right click to drag them around. What? That's weird. Okay, uh so here's what we got. We've got Mark. Um, he's got a higher vitality. She's okay, it doesn't matter too much. Apparently he's got a high dex. Uh, eh, I'll leave it for later. Uh no required equipment. Oh, let's uh let's nix these. I think she gets to keep. Things. Also, that's a legendary sharpened branch. Okay, I don't think we have anything else here. Alright, uh, let's see. So let's close. We want to go here. Adventure, go. Okay, so now that we've got that, what about sub? A leather hat, wooden shield, iron sword, soft leather, fire rat hide, wooden helmet. Okay, uh, let's try the crafts table. Let's see, is this, this is a wooden helmet? What about a... table? Oh. Well. Okay, so he can just make iron. Uh, I was gonna keep him there. Let's move her here. Okay, here we go. So, can we make a... is this a wooden shield? It is, but we need iron ingots. She goes up here. Failed! All materials robbed. I think he got some more stats, though. Alright, uh, let's see. So let's go to you. Uh, his luck went up. What's rest do? Oh, rest is work, not work. Okay, so we're gonna move him there, move her there. Gonna go back to you. Uh, we're going to go on another adventure. Okay, so while we're at it, you need to come back here. And we want to make at least a couple iron ores. Once I have a little bit more money, I'll do some other things. Hopefully, uh, adventuring will kind of make this work. I don't know. Okay, we've crafted an inferior product, product. And we're also paying a small wage every time they make something. Okay, uh, so I, I know I can queue stuff up. Right. We need a staff to handle this, so I'm gonna move her down here. How's he doing? Well, he seems to be doing better this time around, so that's good. Okay, so let's craft this. This will get HP increase level 1, passive skill, junior defense. Ideally, let's actually make two. We need another wooden stick for this. So yeah, uh, also by doing this, we increase our stats, which is kind of neat. Okay, so you needed a wooden helmet. 200 gold. Uh, let's see, want to order a wooden shield. Also gets us a staff, so I'll join the army of Leoman King- uh, Lemon Kingdom in order to stay away from my nagging mother. However, I need a handy equipment first. I want to order a wooden shield. Okay, so let's deliver that. That'll get us a new person. Ding. A brand new wooden shield. It will protect your body. It will protect your soul. It's indestructible. It's flawless. It's... It's just a wooden shield. Ah! It's just a shield! 25, 25 gold, thank you. Shut up and take my money. Thanks for the refer reference. My mother has been nagging me all the time, and you wouldn't shut up either. I was gonna join the army. Maybe I would be quiet, it would be quiet there. However, your shop looks nice. I would work here if you talk less. Way less. Well, anything to stay away from my mom. Hope she can't find me here. Are you hiring staff? You actually talk a lot. But I could use some help here. Why don't you answer me? You are the one who told me to shut up. All right, wow, this is... So we got new staff, so he's gonna be there. Uh, Adventure Man failed. I should probably pay more attention. Um, okay. So I'm gonna keep sending him out. This time around, I'm gonna pay attention to what his HP is. Unfortunately, we're in the middle of a quest. Fortunately, it doesn't pause while that's going on. Okay, 
Uh, so we don't have anything to deliver. What about Maine? No. Can I just sell stuff? So I can just sell it for 35. It's a legendary wooden shield. Oh. Okay, let's, um... Let's have him pull back with those resources for the time being. So he gets a little bit of an HP bonus. Uh, what I was gonna do is detail. Let's give him a, uh, let's give him a shield. Small defense bonus. Should, if we can actually have it that he, uh, reliably can finish these, that'd be good. Okay, uh, let's get, so we need more wooden sticks. What else can we make? We can make a wooden helmet. We can make an iron sword. All he can do is smelt these. And unfortunately, we don't have the ability to pre-make any of this stuff. All right, so leather hat requires small feathers. Can't do those. We also have wooden armor or... Well, unfortunately, without more sticks, we're in trouble. So this guy actually needs to start succeeding at these. Well, I guess that's... Fine. Uh, what can we buy here? So we can buy more furnaces, more enchanters, stuff like that. I should probably see what the enchanter can make. Oh. I see. So if we had fire essence and monster dust, we could enchant these along the way to get basic effects effectively. Okay, that's kind of neat. Nothing I'm terribly interested in right now. Boss skill. It's a pre-order, so two production slots. So that lets me uh, queue up things. Staff wage costs. So yeah, there's... Fair bit of stuff here. Um, let's go with that. Is not really a big fan of most of these designs. Hopefully we unlock more as we go along. Okay, I should probably pay more attention to how this guy's going. Unfortunately, it'd be nice if there's a... Uh, it'd be nice if there's a... What am I thinking? Ooh, that Octorok looking thing is a little scary. It'd be nice if there's a fast forward button along the way here. Uh, looks like we're getting a lot of sticks. We need some ore, though. Okay, so it's a death cap. Oh. Yeah, okay, we're running. So that's, that's part of what kills us. Alright, so you get HP from adventuring. But you get stats from crafting. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Okay, so he's back from the adventure. Uh, let's craft another wooden stick. Uh, let's see. Actually, we need another... We needed that for this. Okay, so that'll be a Vitality Rise level 1. Okay, so your stats aren't good. Let's check uh, people for a second. So Lisa has a higher strength right now. So, yeah, let's... Uh, let's go here. Uh, detail on Mark. Boop, boop. Oh, he never learned that skill. Well, oh, here we go. Trainee. Trainee hero increases 10% attack when facing a boss monster. Mama's boy increases 10% HP growing speed. Joker, save 10% time when crafting. Foodaholic, decreased chance of getting negative status when eating food. Interesting. Well, for the time being, oh, it's an inferior iron sword. Okay, so one hand attack. Ooh. Versus four to six. Okay, so we're just gonna equip the branch for the time being. We need her to go out adventuring. So let's pick up junior defense for the time being. Hope hopefully we can get some more skill slots. Okay. Eyes for monster. I don't know what any of these do. But we might as well pick them up. Uh and there we go. Okay, so she she should be a fair bit stronger here. Hopefully. So we still can't do that, but that's fine. And doesn't look like I can increase the difficulty. Okay. So what can we make here? I need more sticks. And more ingots. Can I? Okay, can make one more ingot. And I can make one more stick. Yeah, if we can get a better sword, maybe we can do better on these adventures. I'm actually really digging this game. So first aid plus, if we want to get an iron hammer. 
versus sharpening basic. Increases weapon by 10%. Restores HP by 20%. Let's, let's learn the iron hammer. Or, let's make an iron hammer. And let's go in here. Let's see, so we've got a warrior's iron hammer. Okay, so I'm gonna sell the inferior wooden sword for the time being. It's garbage. Okay, do we have any new submissions? So some of these have time limits, some of these don't. It looks like. Yeah, so this guy wants a wooden shield. Unfortunately, uh, if I want to make a wooden shield... What do we need resources-wise? We need a wooden stick. Which means I need some branches. Well, she seems to be doing really great here. Let's let's see about this wolf man or rat soldier. Oh god, pull out. Okay, rat soldiers mess you up. Which sucks because we actually needed that stick. Alright. Well, I guess I need to babysit these adventures a little bit more than I thought I would. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna have her go out. It'd be nice if uh there's almost like a, a dual pain. Uh, system so I could actually see both sides. I guess I can just press spacebar regularly, but it would, I don't know, it'd be nice if you could almost queue up one of these to like the bottom of the window or something like that. There's a lot of unused, um... There's a lot of unused space on the, um... on the screen here. For both of these screens. And it'd be nice if you could like move them around. I have to say though, I'm actually really enjoying this game. It's surprisingly close to what I would in, uh, what I want out of a, like, weird weapon crafting game. Uh, it's got the, it's got the hallmarks of pretty much everything I'm looking for. You know, it's got an RPG system that's apparently fairly deep. Um. Okay, I'm just gonna let her get to that. I don't know about the Octrak looking thing. Pull out. Yeah! <laughs> All right, whatever, at least she's getting better stats for this. I, well, we got the money for it, and it's not like we're operating under a time limit here. Which is good, because we're getting our ass kicked. Everything we run into is killer. I thought the chest was gonna be okay, and then it hit me for 80 damage, and I'm like, no! <laughs> never mind! Okay. Well... This gets me some iron ore. Let's just go into, like, over here, or something like that. But yeah, a fast-forward button would be nice. There may be a fast-forward button, honestly. But yeah, her stats are going up. Oh, right, I should have given her the, um... I should have given her the hammer. Oh, well. Yeah, eventually what I'm probably gonna do is just send... Uh... I... I think the first thing I'm gonna probably buy after getting the queue up ability is actually a second horse, so we can send more people out, because if I can have multiple consecutive adventure, or multiple parallel adventurers running, that means that I can sit over here and watch and not feel like I'm totally wasting my time. So we're just gonna go until this tree. I'm not even gonna fight that bee, because I get the feeling the bee is just gonna kick my ass. Uh, but we got a lot of goodies here, and... And we want it. But I guess Lisa is just going to be my adventurer for the time being. Okay, let's pull out. And run away. Okay, good. I was worried for a second. So you do get you do get stats for being out and fighting. I don't know what decks in and luck are all good for, but now we've got now we actually have resources so I can make some stuff. Okay, uh so we wanna make We're gonna make sticks. We wanna make iron. Okay, and let's check that side quest. Sub. Okay, so he wants a wooden, a wooden shield. Doesn't matter what variety. Good. Yeah, we can also sell these, uh, sell what we make, but I'm trying to go for quests right now. More than anything else, and they seem to pop up randomly. Which is good. Okay, uh, sub, wooden shield. Deliver. Yeah, quests always give me just a little bit of extra cash, which is super nice. Okay, so time until next mission. Shortly, so... Once an iron sword past a certain point. I gotta say, these characters gab maybe a little bit too much for... for my taste. But I guess it's not so bad. Wages don't seem like they're a huge issue either. Uh, let's see. Um... 
I'm just gonna make a couple of these. I guess we're gonna need more sticks. I'm, I'm trying to decide exactly what we want to do as far as, like, equipment and stuff goes. I guess let's check her out for a second. So, let's see if I can switch out this for... what do we have? Ah! Okay, we got a Master's Iron Hammer. And let's switch that out for assist. First Aid Plus. Okay, has she mastered this yet? No, EXP getting there. Unfortunately, we can't equip every skill, so maybe, eh, maybe I shouldn't care about mastering them. Hard to say. Okay, uh, is there anything else I can equip her with? Because I think, yeah, no, re no remaining equipment. Well, she should be good, so let's send her out and hopefully she's not going to get her ass kicked. I'll check, I'll check it out momentarily. I guess actually we're at a pretty good stopping point here. Uh, just because I'm kind of low on resources to begin with. Uh, just because we have not been having a whole lot of successful, uh, adventures. To say the least. Okay, let's close that and let's take a look. Alright, so we got a critter. I just really hope this chest is not the evil variety. Okay, so if you're good at timing it, you can pull out as soon as the chest monster shows up. Alright, so it looks like we're in a pretty good spot as far as things go. Okay, deliver. Let's see, two small leather to make armors, 200 gold, new recipe. Okay, so yeah, we're making money. We got Traveler's Hat and Traveler's Shirt, and he still wants these. Okay, yeah. Uh, life's looking good. Oh, interesting. So each of these different characters has, um... Each of these different characters has a different... ...subquest that will, like, unlock extra skill slots and stuff. That's cool. I like that. Okay, uh, so what do we want to do? We want to go to the shop. Can I buy another horse? I could buy another horse. Do we? Yeah, we'll buy another horse. I'd like to get pre-order, but we really haven't been, um... We haven't been put into a position where that's super helpful. So let's just make a couple of iron hammers here. I wish it would tell me the, uh, the end result of the iron hammer I just made. I mean, it'll show up anyway, but it's not a... Eh, I don't know. Whatever. Okay, so we can make Traveler's shirt. Well, we can't do that any, uh, anyway. At least not immediately. Can make a couple of branches, though. And this way we'll be able to have two adventures out rolling for, for resources. Which is an attractive prospect. Let's just hope the end results aren't garbage. Okay, so I'm gonna put him over here. And let's do details, so. We've got the Legend Sharpened Branch, Master's Iron Hammer, or Legend Iron Hammer. Okay, let's give him, let's give him that. We don't have any shields. We don't have any helmets. We do have Grandmaster's armor. Okay, cool. And let's teach him Vitality Rise. And... Assist. Okay, cool. And so these two should be able to both just go out on an adventure. Hopefully kick some ass, I'll babysit them just in case. But, we will be doing that on the next episode of... Whatever the crap this game's name is, because I... Okay, Weapon Shop Fantasy. Yeah, it's so generic that I can't remember it. But I'm actually really having a lot of fun with this game. It's... it's really... quite well done. Mechanically-ish. It's just kinda ugly in a lot of cases, and boy is that translation poor quality. Either way though, I recommend it, actually. I mean, it only cost me like seven bucks. That's... that's dirt cheap, as far as things go. So if you guys like Tycoon games, if you guys liked Holy Potatoes a Weapon Shop, you're gonna like this game. Oh yeah, Weapon Shop Fantasy, it says right there, and I still did- <laughs> I was trying to figure out what the title was, and I was staring at it. Uh, I'm a dunce. Anyway, uh, yeah, if you guys like Weapon Shoppy Tycoon games, this game's perfect. Uh, which is really weird to say, because I honestly thought this was gonna be kind of a wash. But here we are, playing it and enjoying it. So, I guess with this, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Weapon Shop Fantasy. Oh yeah, of course, before I forget, if you guys like this episode, leave me a like, helps more than you know, and if you want to see more, hit subscribe. Because I'm actually probably going to play through this. This is cool. 
it's weird and awkward and whatever, but I dig it. And I can't wait to play more. So, like I was saying, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. I don't trust it with the saving thing, but it probably will. It just scares me.